My story wasn't worth I ain't asked for no money. I asked for street justice. Couldn't even get that. I swear to God, y'all better not say nothing to me. Word to my mother. Word to my mother. Word to my mother. Bronx River, everybody. I'm talking to all of y'all. Word to my mother. I will everybody out this with my knife. I won't back down from nothing. The hood ain't gonna support me. Word to my mother. I'm willing to go out all out with everybody. Everybody. Step outside. I don't give a who got a problem. I'm here in Bronx River right now. Y'all don't like me because of what I said. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Step up right now. Everybody. I'm not backing down from nobody. I'm in the hood right now. Let's go. What I got to be cashy? I ain't asked nobody for 30 million or 50 million. All y'all care about cashy? I'm not going nowhere. Come outside. Come outside. Throw a body while I'm outside. Don't bother why I'm outside. I'm not running nowhere. What's up, y'all? It is I, Nate Almighty. If you new here, go ahead and hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel. Make sure you hit the notification bell. Let's talk about Sean Campbell now. It's been some hours since Hassan Campbell apparently went to Bronx River Projects at 7 in the morning. And he had an epic rant, epic meltdown, plenty of comedy within this live that he went on, plenty of entertainment. It's been an ish show. A lot of people have been talking about it. I want to go about this in a different angle than I've seen everybody going. So bear with me till the end of this video, man. And let me know what y'all think about my opinion and my response to the situation, okay? So, I want to start by giving a disclaimer. Now, my son Campbell is somebody who, regardless of who he is as a YouTube personality now, this is somebody who, back in the days really was a dangerous man in the streets how do i know this is because one of my ogs from calling in the bronx which is the area in the bronx where i come from used to roll with him in their younger days and this is somebody who's whose opinion means something in the hood you know what i'm saying and this is my brother iron chic if y'all know who Iron Sheik is, let me know in the comment section and just go ahead and hit the like button. Iron Sheik is somebody from Cortland who is an OG now. This is somebody who used to get a lot of money in the crack era. This is somebody who did a lot of time, came home, changed his life around. Now he's doing his thing. He's working. You know, he's still rapping, but he working and he handling his business as a man, right? He can vouch for a song. And since that man can vouch for Hassan, and I personally know that man, then I can I have to disagree with anyone on the internet saying Hassan Campbell is at least not like that as far as willing to be violent and put hands on anybody that disrespect him in person. Hassan Campbell is like that. He is. Even if, even if there's, even if there's an inkling that he may be a, a shell of his former self. So the angle I want to go on with this is, after you get over the fact that it makes him look bad, and this epic uh, rant meltdown in the middle of the hood, early in the morning, right? Because you can clearly see the sun coming out as he's going on this rant, right? Even though it's comedy in it, even though it's funny, even though you could ridicule it for him, I think of it this way. I can't help being that, you know, um, being that I know his story and the situation that happened to him when he was a kid. I can't help but feel like he was triggered. He's triggered. When he sees stories that got to do with like abuse and things like that. He's triggered. So he going off about it. The question is, is 
Was this a, 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 a fake PR stunt? Was this a stunt to get views? I didn't think it was, I didn't think YouTube would allow me to, to keep the video up. If I posted the footage of him in the car, claiming to have been shot, then this it's pinned at the top of the video that he's in critical condition, but he only got shot in the leg. But in the video, he seemed to be in pain, but he didn't seem to be dying. And he was able to hold the phone in his face. And so it's like, I don't like, it's speculative, but until the real information comes out that will prove him otherwise and prove that he's lying, you got to take it at face value for now. But my thing is this, this man was triggered. Also, I think a person like Hassan Campbell is conflicted because, because he he wants to be famous. He wants attention, clearly. He wants to be heard, and he feels like people with less of a message get heard more than him. But he got to understand, you know what I'm saying? Um, when you in the woke game, when you in the business of trying to expose celebrities... You know, that ish has a ceiling. It has a ceiling. And then we got to talk about the mental health aspect of it all because I'm hoping, being that it was 7 in the morning, way early in the morning when he went on this rant in the middle of the hood, you still in the middle of Bronx River. Since the song came, was out there standing, yelling, and all that other stuff, you would have people who on the internet think that Bronx River is not like that. And Bronx River is still a dangerous place. So the fact that he would endanger himself like that, either he went there early in the morning because he knew nobody was going to be out. And of course, he had a couple dudes with him. You could tell that. But the mental health aspect of it all, because I'm hoping he was drunk. If he was not drunk, and he went on this epic rant, Hassan Campbell really needs help. You know, and we could joke on people, we could laugh at people, but after a while, you have to you have to pity people. And some people may come in the comments and they'll be like, yo, this is the same person who he dissed the dad and he did this foul thing, that foul thing, that foul thing. Yeah, and and the people who he disrespected and offended need to be prayed for. They need help. And Hassan Campbell needs help too. If he was sober and he went on that rant, because he was actually upset. If he was sober and he went on that rant, okay? The man needs therapy, okay? I don't, like, out of everything he said about what so-and-so did to him, what he been through, I don't remember him ever talking about going to therapy. I never heard him say, hey, uh, besides all that, man, I want to celebrate the fact that I've been going to therapy for the last three months, six months, one year. You know what I'm saying? Never seen that. And it's like, I actually, I grieve for this man. I grieve for that, for Sean Campbell and any other man or woman who's been through similar or worse situations than him. You know what I'm saying? Um, This is a man who clearly is suffering from PTSD, trauma, trigger when other people get affected in a similar way than him. And the whole Cassie thing and bringing up Cassie and, you know, it's like, hey, also, not to be funny, Cassie may have been victimized by just the right person, the right high-profile person. I'm sure a song would have loved to have been able to sue a dude, and I'm not going to say his name, because I don't know if that'll trigger the algorithm or something like that, but I never, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm sure if he could get some bread out of the situation, he could. 
You know what I'm saying? I'm sure he, I mean, I'm sure if he could, he would. You know, but this is a delicate situation. I know that no one else is going to talk about the fact that he's still a victim. And he was triggered. And this is a mental health situation. No one wants to talk about that. Now, yeah, it's funny. Yeah, he embarrassed himself. Ha, 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 rah, rah, rah. But the man really was taken advantage of. And it's still affecting him today in his almost elderly age, man. It's deeper than all this other stuff. But y'all let me know what y'all think of the video. Think, let me know what y'all thought about the video for Son Campbell during that live. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Peace.